Hello there and welcome to the Star Wars Showcase YouTube channel. Got a couple of different tips and pointers for you to build out your very own Black Series Dark Tenebris or other Imperial Inquisitors. Let's take a look. For starters, all of our 3D prints today have been sourced from Bounty Supply Co. on Etsy. I highly recommend checking them out as they have great sales, great rates, and great products. Additionally, if you are interested in any of the figures that I am showcasing today, I've got a couple of them actually available for sale on my eBay page, so that link is in the description if you'd like to check that out and support the channel. Up first, we have our Darth Tenebris custom, who is made using a 3D printed head sculpt as well as the body from our Black Series Grand Inquisitor. I really like the sculpt for the Grand Inquisitor here, as it's a little bit kind of just evil and nondescript, has the nice soft goods cape, which I think really lends itself well for really any kind of Sith Lord character that you're trying to make. The head sculpt from Bounty Supply Co. has a lot of detail to it, and that breather piece is actually removable. So uh, within the figure here, I have painted it separately and then glued it into place. Uh, and I, in addition to doing, you know, a little bit of kind of like a mustard yellow and some tan to get that bit skin tone together, I also used a little bit of a gloss coat on the eyes, as the Bith have kind of those bulbous, very shiny eyes that are very distinctive, and I thought that really helped bring uh, this paint job together. And so with that on top of our Grand Inquisitor sculpt, I think we just have a really solid base for a very easy Sith Lord. Uh, all in all, this project took me, you know, a couple of hours to put together. Uh, I'm using one of the lightsabers from the third sister Black Series release, but you could find any saber that you really like that fits well. And combined with the solid articulation for this figure, I think we're getting just the right amount of menace and malice for this guy. Up next, we have an Imperial Inquisitor that I've put together uh, using one of the nondescript alien species from Star Wars Eclipse, one of the recently announced video game projects that is still in progress. And that head sculpt has been put on top of our Black Series third sister or Reva body. Now, we still don't know all that much about this alien species, uh, or if this video game is even going to see the light of day, but Bounty Supply Co. has done a great job on this head sculpt, and even if we don't know all that much, when you paint it up with some softer blues, a little bit of gray, uh, I think it really comes together for just a nice kind of background character. And so, I think the Riva body has really solid articulation, and with really any head sculpt that you've got, I, I think it's going to work to well uh, come together to make another Inquisitor for you. And finally, we have a more brutish Inquisitor that I put together using the fifth brother body, uh, as well as a Rakatan alien head sculpt. And I don't think Rakatans are really in the Star Wars galaxy by the time of the Empire, but I still like this again. It's just kind of a background alien. He's got kind of that no-necked, very, uh, you know, kind of bulked out and hulking presence to him. And the paint job is a lot of fun, as there's a lot of, like, wrinkles and different details that you're able to work with. And it took me a couple of tries to get kind of the color I liked, this kind of darker, more burnt orange look. Uh, several layers of, of different oranges and kind of yellows uh, alongside some wash coats, but I really like the way this guy came together here. And I think, again, just a very unique alien design that we don't really get a lot of in the Black Series, so it's kind of fun to build out on your own. So uh, these three projects here were a lot of fun for me, just kind of building things out using, you know, your own imagination and, you know, whatever you think. Think you're capable of making and all together I think it really helps build out either your inquisitors or you know your nondescript Sith Lord ranks. So let me know your thoughts down in the comments below about these projects if you have any thoughts or suggestions for different head sculpts or parts and pieces for making out your own Sith Lords or inquisitors uh, as I would definitely love to hear everyone else's ideas. So, thank you so much for watching this video. If you were a fan, please check out some of our other videos uh, with different tutorials for making out action figures of your own, as well as reviews of some of the latest Black Series releases.